As the coronavirus outbreak continues into China and other parts of the world, officials now say more than 250 people are dead as a result of the virus and nearly 12,000 people infected. Strict restrictions now be put in place in the United States and beyond as the virus spreads. News 2's Riley Benson reports. Jing Hoon, known as Chris by his classmates at Academic Magnet High School in North Charleston, is an exchange student who spent the week as a student at the school. Chris says it's been hard to see his country suffer. Uh, I felt very sad when I, heard the, when I first heard that news. Uh, I was shocked because a lot of people died because of the virus. Chinese officials say more deaths on Friday raised the death toll to 259 total lives lost in the country from the lethal virus. Chris says he and the other exchange students remain positive despite the outbreak. Uh, we still have, we're still hopeful and everything will get better. Catherine Spencer, the principal at Academic Magnet High School, says many students, parents, and faculty had their worries about the students' arrival. We all had concerns. These students have been in the country for a couple of weeks now, so things have really unfolded and changed dramatically. Spencer says the school has taken every measure to protect the health of both the exchange students and the community. We've done everything in our power to keep not only our students healthy and safe, but our Chinese students healthy and safe as well. In the meantime, Chris says his time in America has been special. Uh, what uh, impressed me most is the American people. Uh, I think they are very, uh, they are eager to help others. That was Riley Benson reporting. Several Ashley Hall students are currently still in China, the center of the coronavirus outbreak. The school says the students will remain there until the Centers for Disease Control establishes a medically advised protocol.